Good morning, Wildcats. Today is Friday, February 17th, National Cabbage Day. I'm Jack Zhao, and welcome to WCTZ News. Today's episode is sponsored by Honor Murphy Physical Therapy. Get back out there. The NHS is currently collecting items to support high school students who no longer receive foster care support due to their age. See posted flyers for information on needed items, which can be dropped off in guidance. The junior class is currently selling macho matics during power hour in the commons for $5. Now to Cameron with a story on the ban of the generation. Colleges like the University of Auburn and the University of Georgia have banned the use of TikTok on their campus networks and their devices. Sources say the ban stemmed from security concerns regarding the app's China-based parent company ByteDance. I think that there needs to be restrictions passed by Congress. I don't know if it needs to be banned or just limitations put on how much use and how much data can be spilled onto TikTok overall. Students on campus have mixed opinions on whether or not it should be banned. I'm annoyed that TikTok's getting banned on college campuses because next year I'm going to be going to college, so... I do spend a lot of my time on TikTok, and I absolutely love going on TikTok, so it's really annoying that I might not have it next year at college. I think that it's good that it's being banned by colleges because the data hacking is a little scary, honestly. Will this ban affect your final college decision? For WCTZ News, this has been Cameron Coulter reporting. Thank you, Cameron. Today's episode of WCTZ News is also sponsored by Slaughter Insurance. Insurance for the community from a member of the community. The Spanish Honor Society will be holding their monthly meeting on Wednesday during Power Hour A in room 2100. The Omega Omicron chapter of the Zeta Phi Beta sorority has scholarships available starting at $500 for all senior girls. Applications are due March 10th. For more information, scan the QR code on screen. The Beta Mu chapter of the Alpha Delta Kappa sorority also has a $500 scholarship available for women in education. Applications are due March 3rd. For more information, see college specialist Angela Felbush in the Media Center. Now for the alma mater. Thank you for tuning in to today's edition of WCTZ News, sponsored by Honor Murphy Physical Therapy Solutions and Slaughter Insurance. This has been Jack Chow, and have a wonderful day, Wildcats.